Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? Yo, yo, everybody. Okay, so we seem to be working fine so far on the live stream. Guys, let me know at all if it gets laggy or anything like that. <clears throat> Let's throw this up on the down. Why the hell did it do this? All right, call. There we go. Boom. What the fuck? Hang on, guys. Hang on. All right, what's going on, everybody? We are here for the final game of this series between us and the Washington Nationals. By the way, happy Easter to everybody. Happy Easter to everyone that celebrates. Don't forget that the Father has risen, by the way. Um... But yeah, anyways, I'm here for the final game between us and the Washington Nationals. Um, and then, like I said, I'll be back tomorrow night. Uh, I think the game starts at 640 tomorrow night between us and the Philadelphia Phillies to kick off another three-game series. Yeah, game starts at 640 tomorrow night. So I'll be live. Um, shit, I don't know. Let's see. Sits 40. I'll probably be live at like 625, 630 ish. <clears throat> I don't understand. I don't understand. Okay, do I sound choppy to anyone at all? Because on my end, I sound like I might be lagging a little bit. Okay, that would explain why. Yes. Yeah, I was gonna I was gonna tell you that um I called Rebecca and started telling her about the um the shit. The, the 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 aluminum foil and she told me that we have some here at the house so I don't have to go buy any anyway mm -hmm. well I don't know I'll check and look All right, bye. <clears throat> All right, hang on, guys. I'll be right back. I, I just now figured out why this is so choppy. It's because, for whatever reason, the internet cord's not plugged in anymore. It's um, it's solely me running off of Wi-Fi. So, I mean, at least I know my Wi-Fi is good enough to, you know, live stream me if I need to by myself, but... I would rather be using the internet cord. So hang on, I'll be right back, guys.
There we go. Now I should be running off of Ethernet cord. Yep, there we go. Ethernet cord is up and going, boy. So hopefully we won't see that little lag thing anymore because now I'm running off a of straight internet cord. So. All right. But I mean, with the Wi-Fi that I already have, I should have known that it was already good enough for me to um, stream on because we're paying like 173 a month for our internet and cable. And that's because uh, we got one terabyte. I got a full terabyte. What's up to the one person watching? How's everybody doing, guys? We are. What's up to the two people watching? How's everybody doing? We are about three minutes away from first pitch, maybe. Yeah, we're three minutes away from first pitch. First pitch is at 1.40 p.m. So let's uh, read the starting lineups. Again, the starting pitchers today is Jake Irvin for the Washington uh, Nationals and Nick Martinez for the Cincinnati Reds. Starting lineup for the Washington Nationals look almost the same. It's C.J. Ar Arbus, Arbin, Arbins, Ar however the fuck you pronounce his name. Uh, Landon Thomas, Jesse Winker, um, Man Mancini again, Joey Gallo, uh, Razar, Razar, however the hell you pronounce his name, uh, Eddie Rosario, and then Garcia Jr., and then Lipkin is hitting at nine again. So, yeah, their lineup is exactly like it was yesterday. And then for the Reds, it's pretty much all the same. Outside of a few things that changed, it's uh, Jonathan India at the leadoff. Will Benson will be batting second. Christian in the Carcion Strand is still playing first, and he's hitting third. Um, Car Carne Carnello, however the hell you pronounce his name, the guy from the Washington Nationals that we got is playing is batting fourth, and he's playing third base. Jake Fraley is out there today. He's playing right field. Um, Ella De La Cruz is out there, and it says that he's playing third base. So we are, we're going to have two guys playing third base. Nah, nah, he's playing shortstop. Either that or second base. No, Jonathan India is playing second base. Okay, yeah. So um, either one of those guys are playing shortstop. I don't know which one is, and then the other one will play third base. Anyway, Spencer Steer is hit batting seventh. Uh, Nick Martini is in there hitting eighth. And Tyler Stevenson is the catcher today, and he's batting ninth. So, yeah. And here we go with the lagging shit again. Why is it still doing that, even though I got the shit plugged in? Still doing that, even though I got the shit plugged in. Okay, is the live stream still going good and everything? Because it might it might just be my computer doing that at this point, honestly. It might just be my shitty ass computer that I need to get rid of. All right, Nick Martinez. Last season with the pot with the Padres, he uh played in Sitsy three games, started nine of them, he had a six and four record in ERA of three point forty three, a hundred and one innings pitch. Not sure his strikeouts to hit ratio. Wasn't able to read it in time. But we are getting set for a first pitch here at Great American Ballpark in Cincinnati, Ohio. All right, C.J. Abram is first. Landon Thomas is second. Jesse Winker is third. Um, I'll just read them off to you as we go. We are set for first pitch here at Great American Ballpark. 
in Cincinnati, Ohio. Here we go, boys. The final of three games between these two as Abrams is hitting 167 on the year. That one is swung on. It's a high fly pop-up. De La Cruz calling everybody off, and he makes the catch. One out. One out, nobody on, and nobody in here for the Washington Nationals in the top of the first. All right, Landon, Landon Thomas is up now as that one is in there for a strike. Great shit from Nick Martinez so far. That one is swung on and hit foul by Landon Thomas. No balls, two strikes. All right, the, the number one thing I've noticed so far that Nick Martinez needs to work on here is he does throw the ball right down the middle of the plate. As that one is swung on by Landon Thomas, it's up there. Caught on by Spencer Steer out there in left field. Great job, Spencer Steer. Two out, nobody on, and nobody in here. And Nick Martinez not trying to jinx it or anything. Might get out of this first inning with under 10 pitches. He's only at four, and we already got two out. What's up to the three people in the chat? How's everybody doing? Jesse Winker is up now. He swings at that one and hits it foul. No balls, one strike. That one is down in the dirt. One ball, one strike. Nick Martinez up to six pitches on the evening now. That one is swung on and hit foul by Jesse Winker. No balls, two strikes. That one is too high. Eight pitches now. Two balls, two strikes. Come on, Nick Martinez. You can do it. That one is swung on Jesse Winker, and he ripped it in there. He ripped it into right center field, and he's on with a single. He blasted it right through everybody and uh, ripped it right through the infield, right past everybody. And that's one on, two out, nobody in here for the Washington Nationals. As Joey Manessis is up now, he's hitting 500 on the year. As that one is swung on by Joey Manessis. And he ripped it in there to left center field. And we'll have to throw it back in. And that's two hits now. Two on, two out. Nobody in here for the Washington Nationals. And I absolutely 100% jinxed State. My bad, guys. That was on me. As Nick Martinez is now up to 10 pitches. And he will not get out of the first inning without hitting double digits. Joey Gallo is up now as he is 0 for 4, and that's a big hack, and he missed it. No balls, one strike. Joey Gallo last season with the Twins, he played in 111 games. He had 177 um, average. Not sure how many home runs or RBIs. As that one is swung on by Joey Gallo, but he hit it foul. No balls, two strikes now. That one is outside the strike zone. One ball, two strikes now to Joey Gallo. Come on, Nick Martinez.
That one is also outside the strike zone. Two balls, two strikes. All right, two balls, two strikes. Come on, Nick Martinez. Get him out. He takes a look over there at second base where Joey... Um, Jesse Winker is, excuse me. That one is outside the zone. Three balls, two strikes. Come on, man. What started off as a great inning looks like it's about to fall apart here. Oh my god, this is this is just wonderful. What's up for what's up to the four people in the chat? How's everybody doing, guys? Make sure you smack it that like button and get your votes in on the poll as Jesse as Joey uh Gallo hits this one foul and it remains three balls, two strikes. That one is swung on. Joey Gallo, he ripped it up. It is caught on by Jake Fraley. Rake the Jake Fraley catching it out there in right field. And we get out of this one without giving anything up. So let's go, baby. All right. Come on, man. Bottom of the first coming up. Reds do up now. Still tied. Nothing, nothing in this game. Between these two teams, what's up to the three people in the chat? Guys, make sure you're getting your votes in on the poll here, like I said, because I want to know who you got. All right, we got two votes on the poll so far. The question is, will the Reds win this series? And the two votes on the poll says yes, that they will win the series. So we'll see if you guys are right. I'm hoping you are. Because I am a Reds fan myself here. (sighs) Listen, I know that I don't got my jersey on today, but I'm going to have that shit on tomorrow night. I just got to wash it today. All right, Nick Martinez and uh, Tyler Stevenson are talking about something there as we are back. Starting lineup for the Reds again, in case you didn't hear me earlier, it's Jonathan India, Will Benson, Christian and Carcion Strand, Car- Carnello, uh, Jake Fraley, Ella Della Cruz, and I'll read the rest as they come up. Here is Jonathan Indy sitting 375 on the year. That one is to the outside. One ball, no strikes. As Irvin is the one pitching today for the Washington Nationals, Jake Irvin, he appeared in 24 games last season at a three and seven record and he array of 4.61. Not sure how many strikeouts to walk ratio as it is two balls, no strikes now to Jonathan India. As that one is in there for a strike. Two balls, one strike now. Jonathan India can't believe it. That one is swung on by India. Hit straight to the shortstop. He slides it over there and they got him by a mile. Nice grab by the first baseman there. And it is one out. Nobody on and nobody in here for the Reds. Come on, man.
All right, Will Benson is up now as that one is to the outside. One ball, no strikes. Will Benson hitting 286 on the season. Last season, he played in 108 games, was hitting 275, 11 home runs. Not sure how many RBIs. Big hack by Will Benson, but he missed it. One ball, one strike. That's a big hack by Will Benson, but he hit it foul. One ball, two strikes now. Come on, baby. That one is outside the strike zone. Two balls, two strikes now. Come on. Two balls, two strikes. That one is swung on by Will Benson, and he missed it, and that's another out. Two out, nobody on, and nobody in here for the Reds. And the top, and the bottom of the first, excuse me. All right, that one is in there for a strike. As Christian and the Carcion Strand is up now. He does not have a single hit on the season yet. And last season he appeared in 63 games. He had he was averaging a 270, 13 home runs and 27 RBIs, one ball, one strike. That one is in there for another strike. Christian and the Carcion Strand just standing there watching it. One ball, two strikes now. Come on, Reds. That one is in there for a strike. It was a really late call. Get out of here, man. The Washington Nationals have two hits to the Reds, none. Christian Acarcion Strand just stands there and watches it. It looks like he's in La La Land today. Like, he didn't even come to play baseball. I don't understand what the Reds are doing right now, man. This this team makes no sense to me, man. I was a ter- that was That was, once again, a terrible first inning. That was a terrible first inning. Uh, I'm really hoping this team does not is not going to look like this all season. All right, we still only got two votes in the poll. Guys, if you haven't already, make sure to get your votes in as we are heading to the top of the second. Guys, by the way, I did want to remind you, I'll be back for tomorrow night's game. I believe I'm going live at 625, 630-ish, something like that, uh, for the game tomorrow. As we begin a series between us and the Philadelphia Phillies, I'll try to be back on Tuesday as well. I will not be able to do Wednesday's game, though, because I will be at work. So, anyways, we're back as Rosario Rosero is up now as that is one ball, one strike to him, top of the second.
That one is outside the strike zone. <clears throat> that one is swung on. Grabbed on by the first baseman and Christian and Narcarcy on strand while taking himself and that's out number one. That's what we need, man. We need to start shutting this guy down because he <clears throat> has absolutely destroyed us this entire series. All right, as Eddie Rosario is up now last season with the Braves, he only played in 42 games. He had a two point uh two a point two five five average, 21 home runs. I'm not sure how many RBIs, as that one is in there for a strike from Nick Martinez. Let's go, baby. Nick only up to 22 strike. I mean, 22 pitches on the evening. Eddie Rosario tries to lay down a bunt and he misses it, and it snowballs two strikes now. That one is swung on by Eddie Rosario, and he missed it. A nice slider by Nick Martinez, and that's two out, nobody on, and nobody in here for the Washington Nationals in the top of the second. Let's go, man. I love what I'm seeing from Nick here today. Let's go, baby. Yes, sir. Good shit. All right, as Luis Garcia Jr. is up now, that one is a nice curveball straight in there down the middle of the plate, but he just could not get his eyes on it. Last season, Garcia played in 122 games. I'm not sure it's average home runs or RBIs. It disappeared way too quickly. Garcia rips it, second base, thrown over by uh, by Jonathan India, and Christian Nacarcion Strand makes the catch. And that is out number three. Good work from Nick Martinez there. As we are heading to the bottom of the second with the score still tied. Nothing, nothing. Let's go, baby. Oh, what's up? I didn't even notice that you commented. What's up? Oh, yeah. Go Reds. Yes, sir. So far in the first, we have not looked the greatest. Honestly, we have not. All right. As we are back, and I believe Carnello is the one up to bat now for the Reds, as that one is to the outside, and it is one ball, no strikes to him, as Irvin is still in there pitching for the Washington Nationals. He's at 14 pitches on the evening. Bottom of the second, still tied. Nothing, nothing in this game. That one is in there for the strike. What? That was to the outside. As Carnello, uh, last season with the Washington Nationals and the Chicago Cubs, played in 140 games. 
Not sure what his batting average or anything like that was. Disappeared too quickly. One ball, two strikes now as he hits that one foul. And that one is swung on and hit foul. <clears throat> All right, he hit it foul again. That one is swung on and hit foul again, and he's putting up a great fight here. It's still one ball, two strikes. Irvin almost up to 20 pitches on the evening as... He's up to 19 right now. This will be his 20th pitch. What's up to the three people in the chat? How's everybody doing? As that one is, has swung on, and they're going to say that he broke the plane, and that's an out. Oh, my God, man. Oh, that was outside the strike zone. Yeah, he broke the plane by a mile and a half. Oh, uh, yeah, the Reds so far has not looked great. All right, Jake the Rake Fraley's up now. I went swung on. Jake the Rake Fraley does it. He hit it in the single. He hit it into center field and gets on for a single. Let's go, baby. Yes, sir. Let's go, Jake the Rake Fraley, baby. He sent that one right back where it came from. Straight up center field, and it is now one on, one out, and nobody in here for the Reds as Ella De La Cruz is up now. And that one is swung on by De La Cruz. Jake, out. And they got both, and just like that, the fucking inning is over for with the Reds. Are you kidding me, man? De La Cruz hits into a fucking... Double play, and yeah, outside of Jake Fraley so far, man, this has not been a good start to this game either for the Reds, as we are heading to the top of the third, still tied, nothing, nothing. What did I tell you yesterday? What did you tell me yesterday? I can't remember. Oh, man, what a joke. What's up to the five people in the chat? How's everybody doing? <clears throat> Nate Martinez is doing pretty good, but mm, the Reds hitter hitting? No, nah, not so much. Uh oh. What the fuck? All right. Anyways, we are back to the game as Lipkin is up now for the Washington Nationals. That one is apparently too far to the outside. One ball, no strikes. TJ Freddle last season played in 138 games. He was hitting 279. 
13 home runs and 28 RBIs. That one has swung on as he missed it. One ball, one strike now. Nick Martinez is up to 28 pitches for the Reds. <clears throat> That one is swung on in a nice slider down in the dirt, and it's one ball, two strikes now to Lipcomb. Lip lip that one is swung on, grabbed on, third baseman. What are you doing? Throws it over. He got him still. Wow, let's go, baby. As that was Cane Car Carnello, Car Carrello, however the hell you pronounce his name there, at third base. I have no idea what the hell he was doing there. He literally caught the ball, and then he just stood there with it for a minute and then threw it over and got him out still, luckily. That one is in there for a strike. <laughs> Nick Martinez up to 31 pitches on the evening as we are back to the top of the order as Arby's, Ar 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 Arbums is up now as he is 0 for 1 on the evening. And they're going to say that he did break the plane. No balls, two strikes. Let's go. Come on, get him out. Damn, that one's down in the dirt. One ball, two strikes now. <clears throat> that one is outside the strike zone. Two balls, two strikes. That one is swung on and hit foul. Going to remain two balls, two strikes now. That one is swung on and hit foul again. Remaining two balls, two strikes. Come on, man. <clears throat> Hit it, and it goes foul again. Two balls, two strikes. Still. <clears throat> Nick Martinez almost up to thirty pitches on the evening. Now he's at thirty-seven. I mean, he's almost up to forty. Excuse me. That one is swung on. Abram, he rips it. That's high fly. He knew it from the second it went off of his bat. And that is a no-doubter home run. one nothing. Washington Nationals lead it over the Cincinnati Reds. Nick Martinez tried to lay a slider down in there and just got absolutely hammered on as that one is to the outside. And it is one ball, no strikes now to Landon Thomas. Thomas is 0 for 1 on the evening with a, with a uh, fly out, I believe it said. That one was a slider right down Broadway again. Luckily, Landon Thomas misses this one. One ball, one strike. That one is swung on Landon Thomas, hit foul. <clears throat> that one is down in the dirt, two balls, two strikes.
this hobby is starting now. Probably wouldn't have it anyway. I think he had pitched well enough. Sick Lodolo is dealing with his first rehab out in the AAA. No one is swung on. High fly pop up. Three people coming in, and the right fielder makes it there. Will Benson, he makes the catch, and that is two out. Nobody on, and nobody in. I mean, two out, nobody on, and one in here for the Washington Nationals in the top of the third. All right, Justin Wing comes up now. He's one for one on the evening. That one's a big hack. He missed it. No balls, one strike. Jesse Winker, one for one with a single back in the first. We'll see what he can do this time as it snowballs one strike. That one is just to the outside. Come the fuck on, man. If you're going to call that shit for the Washington Nationals, call it for us too, motherfucker. One ball, one strike. Get out of here, man. That one is swung on, and Jesse Winker hit it straight off of his foot, and it's one ball, two strikes. He hit him. What the fuck are you doing, man? How do you have no balls, two strikes, and you whack him right on his fucking elbow? Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. It looks like the Reds are going to be the same fucking Reds from years past. Nothing has changed about this team. One on, two out, and already one in here. As Manson is up now, that one is in there for a strike. No loss, one strike. Joey Manson, he's one for one on the evening with a single back in the first. That one is to the outside. One ball, one strike now. And uh, Nick Martinez is up to 49 pitches. He's already almost he's already almost at 50. He's already halfway to 100, and we're only in the top of the third. That one is down in the dirt. Terrible fucking throw. And two balls, one strike, and now he's at 50 pitches. All right, here we go. That one is swung on, and it's just going to be a pop out to left field. Thank God, and that ends the inning. And the Reds only gave up one there, as it is now three to, or it is now one to nothing as we head to the bottom of the third. As the Reds have not looked great on offense so far. And Nick Martinez, that was probably his worst inning so far.
All right, bottom of the third. Now, Spencer Steer is up now as it is one ball, no strikes. Irvin still out there pitching for the Washington Nationals. He's only at uh, 23 pitches. As that one is to the outside as well. Two balls, no strikes now to Spencer Steer. Steer hitting 286 on the season. That one is to the outside as well. Three balls, no strikes. Come on, Spencer Steer. That one is to the outside, and Spencer Steer is on with a four-ball walk. Let's go, baby. All right, one on. Nobody out and nobody in here for the Reds as Nick Martini is up now to bat for the Reds. Let's go, Nick Martini. That one is outside the strike zone. One ball, no strikes to Nick Martini. Martini hitting a solid 600 on this season so far he had two home runs on opening day comes in yesterday as a pitch hitter and got two more rbis that one is to the outside as well two balls no strikes to nick martini as Irvin is up to 28 pitches now That one is in there for a strike. Two balls, one strike now. As last season, Nick Martini appeared in 29 games. He had an average of 264, six home runs, and I'm not sure how many RBIs. Two balls, one strike now. That one is to the outside. Three balls, one strike now to Nick Martini. Come on. That one is in there for a strike. Three balls, two strikes. Throws it over to check on Steer at first base. He is back in there second. All right, back in there safely, excuse me. Steer stealing. He is in there safely, I think. Wait, I think he's going to be safe either way because I think that call got, I think he got called ball four. So it doesn't matter. All right, Tyler Stevenson is up now. Last season, he appeared in 142 games. And an average of 243, 13 home runs, 56 RBIs. As the pitch, as the pitching coach is going to come out to have a talk with his pitcher and apparently all of the rest of the infield. All right, two on, nobody out, and nobody in here for the Reds in the bottom of the third. Come on, Reds.
All right, here we go. That one is in there for a strike, straight down the middle to Tyler Stevenson, and he just stands there and watches it. No balls, one strike. That one is in there for another strike. Tyler Stevenson just standing there watching him, man. Come on. That one is outside the strike zone. One ball, two strikes. Come on, Reds. That one is outside the strike zone as well. Two balls, two strikes now to Tyler Stevenson. Two on, nobody out, and nobody in here for the Reds just yet. Come on, man. That one is to the outside as well. Three balls, two strikes, full count now to Tyler Stevenson. Irvin is almost up to 40 pitches on the evening. That one is swung on by Tyler Stevenson, grabbed on by the third baseman, thrown over. They did get him out, but both runners advanced one out, and runners are now at third and second. Let's go, baby. That's what you love to see. Oh, we got a great opportunity to score here. That one is outside the strike zone. All right, one ball, no strikes now to Jonathan India. Back to the starting lineup. That one is outside the strike zone as well. Two balls, no strikes. Irving up to 40 pitches on the evening now. Like I said, if anyone's just joining us, uh, Spencer Steers at third base, Nick Martini at second for the Reds. Now two balls, no strikes to Jonathan India with only one out. Jonathan India rips it in and he is going to get it out. And I don't think it was out far enough to bring in a run. Yes, it was. Let's go. I didn't think Spencer Steer would try it, but he did in this game side. <laughs> Fucking go two out. One on and one in here for the Reds. We are now tied one to one between the Reds and the Washington Nationals. Let's go, baby. All right, as Will Benson is up now, he swings at that one, but was a bit too fast with it as it snowballs one strike. That one is outside the strike zone. One ball, one strike now to Will Benson. <clears throat> Will Benson rips it in. He gets it down and out of left field. Here comes Nick Martini. He scores. And Will Benson is in there with a stand-up double. Reds take the lead. Let's fucking go, man. Great hitting, Will Benson. Oh, uh, yeah, he did the same thing that Nick Martinez did. 
He tried to lay a slider down right over the center of the plate, and Will Benson was not having any of it. He knocked it in there to left field. Let's go, baby. All right, as Christian Encarcion strain is in now, as Owen is to the outside, one ball, no strikes. Will Benson is the first red with a double in each of his last three games or season since Scott Shebler. He throws it over to check on Will Benson, and Benson is back in there safely. Wow, Will Benson, a gifted third base there. I have no idea why. Oh, I think Irvin did a little turnaround fake thing and then had to wait for the second baseman to get there. So that screwed him, and we got an instant uh, gift to third base there. All right. Now can Christian and Acarcion strand capitalize off of it? That one was right over the mid or left side of the plate, but he was too late on the swing there, and it's one ball, one strike now. That one is swung on. Christian and the Carson Strand hits it foul. One ball, two strikes now. Come on, baby. That one is too high. And he swung at one outside the fucking strike zone, man. What are you doing? All right, anyways, we're heading to the top of the fourth, and the Reds now lead it 2-1 to one over the Washington Nationals. I can't be too mad. That was a very great inning for the Reds, but we'll see if it stands up because we know how yesterday went. As that one is rich foul as Joey Gallo is back up at start the fourth off as it is no balls, one strike. Sorry about that, guys. All right, as we are, Nick Martinez is still in there pitching. He's up to 52 pitches. That one's just a pop-up. Third baseman comes over, and he will grab it on as it is Can uh, Car Carnello, or however the hell you pronounce his name, as that is one out. Nobody on and nobody in here for the Washington Nationals and the top of the fourth.
All right, Nick Martinez is up to 53 pitches on the evening. That one apparently a little bit too far to the outside. One ball, no strikes. As Rizzo Rosario is up now as he is 0 for 1 on the day. This is the guy that we need to shut down. He's been destroying us all series long. Is that one just a pop-up? Grabbed on. Third baseman once again. That's two quick outs. Two out, nobody on, and nobody in here for the Washington Nationals in the top of the fourth. Come on, baby. Nick Martinez up to 55 pitches on the evening now as Eddie Rosario is in. He's woe for one on the evening as that one is a bit to the outside. One ball, no strikes. That one is swung on and hit foul. One ball, one strike now to Eddie Rosario. That one is in there for a strike. One ball, two strikes now. Come on, Nick Martinez. Hell yeah, let's go, John, as that is a strikeout, a swing and a miss by Eddie Rosario, and he is out of there. Hell yeah, John, that's awesome, man. Yeah, I want to I wanna start going to church again, but with the, little, with the little ones and my fiance working on weekends and shit, I don't really ever have time to go to church, you know, so. But yeah, I would absolutely love to start going to church again. All right, we are back to the game. That one is outside the strike zone to Carnello, Car, Car, Carello, Carnello. As that is one ball, no strikes. That one is straight down center Broadway, and he just sits there and looks at it. One ball, one strike now. As Jamar Carrello Car Car is 0 for 1 on the evening. As that one is swung on and he hit it foul. One ball, two strikes now. Irvin is still the one pitching for the uh, Washington Nationals. He's up to 51 pitches on the evening. That one is to the outside. Two balls, two strikes now. Come on, baby. That one is to the outside as well. Full count, three balls, two strikes.
<sighs> that one is swung on. Hit foul. Remains three balls, two strikes. That one is swung on and hit foul again, and it's still three balls, two strikes. It looked like it got the catcher right in the hoo and he – I'm pretty sure you wear cups, but apparently that still hurt him somehow. Actually, it may have got him in the hand because I've just seen him flood his hand out like this and look at it. So maybe it got him in the hand. That one is ripped in, but Haynes in the air too long and it's caught on by the center fielder. One out, nobody on and nobody in as that's Eddie Rosario out there playing center field for the Washington Nationals today. Nice swing by... uh, by the hitter there, it just hung in the air too long. And Jake Bailey is up now. It's one for one. Rips it in again. And he lines one in again. This one in the right field. And he's in there with another single. What a hit by Jake the right Fraley. Let's go, baby. He's two for two on the evening. That one is caught in there for a strike. De La Cruz does not agree with it, and neither do I. As Ayla De La Cruz is 0 for 1 on the day with a ground out into a double play last time in. No balls, one strike. That one is half swung on by De La Cruz. They're going to say that he actually held up in time. Wow. Okay. And I'm not going to argue that because the Reds are my favorite team, but I definitely think he broke the plate there as they will throw it over to check on uh, Jake Fraley at first base. He is back in there safely. That one is down in the dirt. Jake Fraley, he's back in there safely at first base. Two balls, one strike now. Damn it. Jake Fraley was stealing second base. Ah, he went before the pitcher threw the pitch, and yeah, that costed him there. As they'll say that he held up in time again. Three balls, one strike. All right, three balls, one strike. Now to De La Cruz, two out, one on. That one is swung on. De La Cruz, it's with tie, and it gets down. De La Cruz, he's coming around. De La Cruz, he's in the third. And our run comes in, I believe. Yes, it does. De La Cruz does it again. I thought that one had a chance of getting over the wall for a minute, but it fell just shy. Yes, sir. 
All right, two out, one on. Up now is Steer. And that one's ripped on. Steer, he hits it in the center field, and now it's three to one. I don't know why, but there for a minute, they were acting like Jake Fraley was still on base. So that was going to be three to one. But now Spencer Steer hit it on, um, hit it on there, and it is now three to one. Let's go, baby. Good shit. All right. That one is apparently in there for a strike. What? I believe Nick Martina and uh, Nick Martini is the one in there now. As yes, he is. He walked back in the third inning. Later came around to score. No balls, one strike to him. Spencer Steer on at first base. Nick Martini. He lines one in there to left field. And the Reds are just tearing him apart here. As Urban is up to 55 pitches, and the Reds are just going crazy with hits right now. As Nick Martini says, get that little slider out of here, and absolutely rokes it in the left field there. And it's two on, two out, and one already in here for the Reds. All right, as Tyler Stevenson is up now, and the pitcher is going to What's up to the four people in the chat? How's everybody doing? As we are back after the pitcher went out to go talk to his starting pitcher here, or the catcher, I mean, excuse me, as that one is to the outside. Tyler Stevenson up now. He's 0 for 1 on the evening as it is one ball, no strikes. Tyler Stevenson, like I said, 0 for 1 on the evening with a ground out back in the third. That one is to the outside. Two balls, no strikes now. 3-1, Reds lead it already. Two out, two on, and one in here already for the Reds. That one is in there for a strike. Nice slider there as it is now two to one. Our two balls. One strike, excuse me. That one is swung on by Tyler Stevenson, but he hits it foul. Two balls, two strikes now. Come on, Tyler Stevenson. That one is to the outside. Three balls, two strikes, full count. Come on, Tyler Stevenson. That one is swung on by Tyler Stevenson. Grabbed on, thrown over. They got him. Ah, oh, man, that's out number three, but what a great inning for the Reds there. They had a lot of hits and got a run in to make it now three to one. All right, top of the fifth coming up. Guys, if you haven't already, make sure that you do vote on the poll as we are out to five votes on the poll. The question is, Will the Reds win the series? And all five votes so far has said yes. And someone off of Facebook just said, Happy Easter. Happy Easter to you as well and everybody else in here. Thank you guys for coming in. And let's go see who that was on Facebook that said that.
Oh, it's Michael. Matt, why are you on there and not on YouTube? All right, as we are back to the game, boys, let's do this. Well, we are back to the game, top of the sixth now coming up as the Reds lead it by two now as Nick Martini has. He's up to 59 pitches. He pitched in four innings, allowed three hits, one run, run one earned run, and two strikeouts. All right, Garcia Jr. is up now as he is 0 for 1 on the evening. That one is outside the strike zone. One ball, no strikes. That one is outside the strike zone as well. Two balls, no strikes now. What the hell? Top of the fifth. Are we? I thought we. Oh yeah, we are in the fifth. I'm stupid as hell. I actually put top of the sixth. Whoops. Two balls, no strikes. That one is swung on, and he get lines it in there to right center field, picked up by Drake Fraley, and tossed back in as Garcia Jr. will get on with a single. As Nick Martinez is now up to 62 pitches on the evening. Lip, Lipkum is up now as he is 0 for 1 on the evening. That one is in there for a strike. No balls, one strike. Trey Lipkum is 0 for 1 on the day with a ground out back in the third inning. That one is swung on. And that one is in there to center field as a great throw by Will Benson. We'll get it back in before any of them can advance anywhere else. But two on, nobody out, and nobody in just yet for Washington. Come on, man. That's what I mean by, by the Reds always be falling apart. All right, as Abram is one for two on the evening. That one is swung on and he hit it foul. No balls, one strike. No balls, one strike. That one is a bunt on down. Throws over. They got him. Let's go, baby. All right. Great job by Nick Martinez there. That's one out. One out, two on, and nobody in here as Landon Thomas is up now. He's 0 for 2 on the evening. Nick Martinez at 66 pitches. He lines one in there. That might bring a run in, and it does. And here comes the other one, and he's also in there. And this game's tied.
Uh, Nate Martinez, six, 67 pitches. Jesse Winker up now. He's one for one. Throws it over to check on Landon Thomas. And Landon Thomas is back in there safely. One on, one out, and two in here in the top of the fifth for the Washington Nationals. This game's tied once again, 3-3. Three, three. That one is a bit too high as it's one ball and no strikes. Jesse Winker, one for one with a single, and he was hit by pitch last time he was up. That one is swung on and hit foul. One ball, one strike now. That one is swung on. Bruh, I'm not sure about that. I think he got the tag way before he was there. Yes. He's out. He's out. He's out, man. He is out. He's out. All right, this is being challenged by the Reds for anyone just joining us. Landon Thomas tried to uh, steal second base. The call is being challenged right now. He was ruled safe, and I believe he's going to be called out here. No, me neither. Wow. What? Bro, that's crazy. 
So in case you guys didn't just hear my TV, uh, he is called safe at second, which is complete bullshit because De La Cruz, if that's the case, De La Cruz should have been safe at second yesterday too. Ha, huh, what a fucking joke, man. One ball, two strikes, Jesse Winker, Nick Martinez, up to 71 pitches on the evening now. That one is not swung on. Two balls, two strikes. All right, two balls, two strikes now. That one is swung on, hit up and out of play, and it remains two balls, two strikes. Oh, my God. Come on, man. That one is swung on. And, ah, come on, man. I thought he missed it for a minute. But, nope, he hit it foul again. And it's still two balls, two strikes. Nick Martinez up to 74 pitches on the evening. That one is down in the dirt. And it's three balls, two strikes. That one is swung on by Jesse Winker, and he ripped it foul again. Still three balls, two strikes. That one is outside, and he walked in. Oh, dude, this is wild. Oh, my God. All right, two on, one out, and two in here in this, or no, maybe that was last inning. I don't think anybody has scored here yet. As that one goes foul, and it snowballs one strike now to Manson. Manson is one for two on the evening. Martinez is up to 78 pitches on the evening. That one is swung on, hit foul, and it's no balls, two strikes now.
Dude, no, he didn't. One ball, two strikes. It looks like Manson went around to me, but according to first base coach, he held up. I mean, first base umpire, excuse me. That one is to the outside. Two balls, two strikes. My Nick Martinez is up to 81 pitches on the evening. That one is in that four strike. Manson is not happy with that call at all, and that's an out. All right, Joy Gallo. Bro, no fucking shot. Ha. All right, well, the runners are at the corners now. Two out, nobody on. I mean, nobody in and two out. And it's two balls, no strikes to Joey Gallo as Nick Martinez is up to 84 pitches on the evening. That one is swung on by Joey Gallo and he missed it. Two balls, one strike. Come on, Nick Martinez. <laughs> that one is way too high for Joey Gallo. Three balls, one strike. Nick Martinez up to 86 pitches on the evening, man. He needs to be taken out. No, Michael, what the fuck? No, we do not do our shit this early in the morning. And that's another strike. Let's go. Three balls, two strikes. Yes, sir. We're not even having our Easter egg hunt until later on in the day. No, we have not done the cookout yet. I'm literally calling the game. Going to go back. And then I'm going to start grilling the food. That one is swung on by Joey Gallo up and out of play. Three balls, two strikes. No, we we do not do our our stuff that early. That one is swung on. Joey Gallo pops it up. Tyler Stevenson coming out. He's going to have a look, but it goes flying into the crowd. And that's going to remain three balls, two strikes. Uh, no, you're not. Trent, that is a family thing. As that one is popped up by Gallo. And Stevenson catches it. All right. I mean, Steer catches it. Spencer Steer makes the catch there. And that will end the inning as we are going to the bottom of the fifth. All right, bottom of the fifth coming up with the Cincinnati Reds due up. This game is now tied um, as we are tied at 3-3 now. 
We got six votes on the poll. The question was, will the Reds win the series in 100? And all six of you guys are saying yes. Yeah. A, it's a family thing. And two, their feelings is kind of hurt that Ashley's not coming to the cookout. So I'm pretty sure if you came, they would be even more pissed because they, they would be like, why the fuck is he coming but not her? Like, type thing. You know what I'm saying? But, I mean, don't, don't tell Ashley I said, said that either. But, yeah, I mean, it is what it is. All right. Come on, man. The Reds need to get back in this shit, dude. It is ridiculous that we had the lead and then lost the lead. Well, we didn't lose the lead, but you know what I'm saying? It's fucking tied. All right, here we go. As Jonathan India is back up, we are back up to the top of the order for the Reds and the bottom of the fifth. Jonathan India is 0 for 2 with two ground outs. Not make this up. India is just getting so unlucky. Right to C.J. Abram, and that's out number one. You don't want to make who mad. And that one is straight down Broadway. And Will Benson just sits there and watches it. No balls, one strike. Will Benson, one for two on the evening. That one is outside the strike zone. One ball, one strike now. That one is outside the strike zone as well. Two balls, one strike. That one is swung on Will Benson. He ripped it in the right field. And Will Benson is on with a single. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Great shit, Will Benson. Yes, sir. Will Benson, two for three on the evening now. All right, I believe Christian in the car scene on strain is up, and he is. He's 0 for 2 on the evening. That one is to the outside. One ball, no strike. Christian in the car scene on strand still does not have a hit on the season. Let's hope that he can get one here. He's 0 for 2 on the evening with two strikeouts. That one is in there for a strike. One ball, one strike now. That one is outside the strike zone. Two balls, one strike. My God, Kansas City Royals is beating the Minnesota Twins 10 to nothing, and it's only in the bottom of the third. Wow. That one is swung on by Christian in the car on Strand, and he grounds into a double play. 
That is on fucking real, man. Oh my god, unreal, and this game is still tied. All right, guys, hang on, I'll be right back. All right, sorry about that, guys. All right, I believe the Reds are making a pitching change here, and they are taking Nick Martinez out and putting in... <clears throat> that one is swung on, high fly. Will Benson coming up, and he makes the catch. Yes, sir, out number one. And that was a really quick out, and now I can read off to you guys who's out there. As it is Amelo Pe Pagano, Pe Pagano uh, Thursday versus the Nationals. He went one inning, two hits, two earned runs, and only one strikeout. That one is in there for a strike. Eddie Rosario is up now. Oh, it is. Swung on by Eddie Rosario. Hit foul. And it snowballs two strikes now. That one is in there for a strike. I thought it was a little bit down too far, but I'll take it. Matty Rosario's not happy about it. And so far, this pitcher is doing better than he did on Thursday. I was in there for a strike. Luis Garcia Jr. is one for two on the evening. That one is down the dirt. One ball, one strike. That one is swung on, and he missed it, as it is one ball, two strikes now. Uh, 
Come on, get this out. That one is down in the dirt. Two balls, two strikes. He got him. Let's go. One, two, three inning for this pitcher that comes in. Let's freaking go, man. What a great pitching sequence there. Bottom of the sixth, we go. All right. Nick, De Nick Lodolo with Louisville today went five innings like he was supposed to, and I'm not sure how what he had. All right, here we go. Bottom of the sixth as Carnello is up now. He's 0 for 2 on a day. That one is straight down Broadway, and he just sits there and watches it. No balls, one strike. That one is off to the side, and it is one ball, one strike now. Garcia is in pitching now for the Washington Nationals. That one's still also to the outside. Two walls, one strike now. All right, that was just a great pitch there. Bottom of the zone. He half swung at it and held up right in the middle of his swing, but already broke the plate. Nonetheless, it was inside the strike zone, so he would have struck out anyways, but he's out. All right, Jake Fraley's in now. He's two for two on the evening. One out, nobody on, nobody in here for the Reds in the bottom of the sixth. One ball, no strikes to Jake Fraley. Come on, Fraley, as Garcia is up to six pitches now. That one is in there for a strike. A nice fastball at the bottom of the zone.
That one is swung on by Jake the Rake Fraley, and he hit it foul. One ball, two strikes now. That one is swung on. Jake the Rake Fraley, he dips it inside to center field. And Jake the Rake Fraley is on fire today. He's three for three. That one is straight down Broadway, and Jake Fraley did not miss it. All right, here we go. De La Cruz is one for two on the evening now as well. One on, one out, and nobody in here as he hits that one. And it's another almost double play. They got Jake Fraley at second base but could not get De La Cruz. And it's two out, one on, and nobody in here for the Reds. Come on, De La Cruz, man. All right, Spencer Steer is up now. He's one for one on the evening. Check over on De La Cruz at first base, and he's back in there safely. That one is outside the strike zone. And it is one ball, no strikes. That one is swung on by Steer, and it's just going to go up and out of play. Bro, my man's had a shot at catching the ball and he missed it. That's terrible. <clears throat> All right, one ball, one strike now. That one is swung on. Steer. He makes it. De La Cruz, he's also in there. De La Cruz still second. He stole third from second, excuse me, what I meant to say. And Steer makes it in with a, a safe on first. Somehow, all he did was half bun it and outbeat the throw. Let's go, man. <clears throat> Let's go, man. Runners on the corners with steel, only two outs. Nick Martini popped it up. Ah, Jesse Winker makes the catch. As we are heading to the top of the seventh, we are still tied 3-3. Reds have nine hits to Washington only uh, six, but somehow still tied. All right, top of the seventh coming up. <clears throat> guys if you haven't got your votes in yet make sure that you do because we are going to be ending the poll at the top of the ninth inning so you got a little bit left while
before we do end up. What the hell? That's wild. That is absolutely wild. <clears throat> All right. Hey, it's my man, Buck Farmer. He's in here. Let's go, Buck. That one is in there for a strike. Nice top of the zone strike. As we are back, top of the seventh, Lipcomb, Lipcomb is in now, and he is uh, one for two on the evening. That one is a bit to the outside and down in the dirt. One ball, one strike. Trey Lipcomb is one for two with a single back in the fifth inning. Later came around to score. <clears throat> That one is swung on, and he missed it. One ball, two strikes. That one is swung on, hit up and out of play, and it's going to remain one ball, two strikes. That one is swung on by Lipcomb. It's back there. It is. Did he catch it? Fuck. Will Benson didn't catch it, and the Reds are losing. Allen's in there for a strike. Back to the top of the order. CJ Abram is up. He's one for two with a solo home run and a sacrifice bunt. No balls, one strike. That one's in there for a strike as well. No balls, two strikes now. What? Nobody out, nobody on, and one in here for the Washington Nationals with a leadoff solo home run from Lookum. I want to swung on as it is up and out of play for CJ Abram. No balls, two strikes still is the count. No one is swung on. Hit high, fly up. Tyler Stevenson, and it's off the netting. <clears throat> Keep 
All right, no balls, two strikes. That one is swung on, and he hit it foul again. Still no balls, two strikes. Buck Farmer already up to 10 pitches, and he doesn't even have a single out on this inning. Terrible. That one is swung on and hit foul. And it snowballs two strikes. That one is swung on. Grabbed on. Jonathan and he had second base. Got him out. Let's go. One out. Nobody on. And one in here for the Washington Nationals in the top of the seventh. All right. Come on. We need two more outs, man. Oh, my God. Guys, by the way, I will be back tomorrow night for the game between us and the uh, uh, Philadelphia Phillies as that one is outside the strike zone to Landon Thomas as it is one ball, no strikes. But, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow for the game between us and the Philadelphia Phillies to kick off a three-game uh, series between them. That one is in there for a strike. One ball, one strike now. As Landon Thomas is one for three, he had a two-run single. That one is swung on by Landon Thomas, grabbed on by the third baseman, thrown over. They got him. Two out, nobody on, and one in here. But, yeah, um, I will be here for tomorrow night's game, and I'm hoping Tuesday night's game I should be off of work by the time that it starts. And then I'm hoping uh, – well, actually, I'm not even hoping there is no way to do the final game of the series because uh, the game starts at 140 on Wednesday, and I'll unfortunately be at work at that time. So – as that one is ripped on by Jesse Winker. It's way back there. And it is a double play. All right. Jesse Winker standing up in second base. That one is out of the strike zone. One ball, no strikes, two outs, one on, one already in here. As I believe Manson is the one up now hitting. That one is up and gets him. <clears throat> two on, two out, and one already in here. Buck Farmer up to 18 pitches. Gallo now. That one is swung on and he missed it. No balls, one strike. Oh, man. So just like yesterday with the shitty ass catching today, it's the pitchers hitting people with balls. We've already seen it two or three times now. And it's screwing us, man. One ball, one strike now. That one is swung on at one down in the dirt. One ball, two strikes. Nice slider there by Buck Farmer. Farmer up to 21 pitches already in this inning. Absolutely freaking terrible, man. That 
That is down in the dirt. Two balls, two strikes. Now it is outside the strike zone. Three balls, two strikes. Yo, what's up, Tristan? Three balls, two strikes. Are we really going to load these fucking bases? The answer would be yes, we are. Four balls, two strikes, bases loaded, two outs, one in, and the Reds are about to lose this fucking game again. Oh, my dear, sweet baby Jesus, man. All right, here we go. As Ruiz is up now, he's 0 for 3 on the evening. But we'll see what he can do here. That one is in there for a strike. No balls, one strike. Let's go, baby. No balls, one strike. That one is too high. One ball, one strike now. That one is swung on and hit foul. No, one ball, two strikes. That one is too high. Two balls, two strikes. Buck Farmer, 28 pitches, man. To have almost 30 fucking pitches in one inning is terrible. That one is swung on. Hit foul. Still going to remain. Two balls, two strikes. That one is swung on, hit foul, and it's going to remain two balls, two strikes. Buck Farmer up to 30 pitches on the evening. This is terrible. That one is swung on and he missed it. It was outside the strike zone. Way to work out of it, Buck. Let's go, baby. Still terrible that it took him 31 pitches, but thank God he didn't give up any other runs. We're heading to the bottom of the seventh with the Reds only down by one. Let's go, baby. Ah, shit.
What's up? When the hell did you get iPhone? I've been having an iPhone. I got an iPhone like last year. Oh, so you just now decided to take my number. What the fuck? Motherfucker, did you get my number? <laughs> no. I didn't even know that you had iPhone. The fuck? It works both ways. It works both ways, buddy. Listen, today was the first day you asked me anything about having iPhone, all right? Because I knew you had an iPhone, but if I wanted to call you or text you, I always got Facebook friends. Anyway, anyway, uh, <clears throat> shout out to uh, Sticky Piston. He made a new Twitch channel. Um, if you want to go check him out. <laughs> yeah, ain't nobody on YouTube watch fucking Twitch. Uh, send me the link to it. Alright, I will. Alright. How's the game going? Uh, fucking Reds are losing, of course, you know? Like always. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't expect much. I'm not gonna tell you. I'm not gonna lie to you. <sighs> I thought I thought we had a chance to have a good season, but apparently fucking not. So, you know. I think I was the only one in the poll that you put up that said, uh, do you think the Reds are going to win the series? And I was like, no. I don't even watch baseball. I don't even watch baseball, and I said no. Wow. It's all good, though. They might they might hit a comeback or whatever. I don't know how close it is to the end of this season, but they might, they might get Well, shit, the season just started, so I'm not worried about any of that. But, you know, like, fucking, this is shitty when you can't beat the fucking Washington Nationals. <clears throat> Hopefully. Anyways, bro, I'll send you the link, but I'm gonna let you go so you can get back to the stream. I'll keep watching, give you those uh those few hours, you know. Yeah. All right. Thank you. All right. See you. Love you. Bye. Later. I love you too. Oh, ha- happy Easter. Happy Easter. Happy Easter to you as well, sir. Bye. Dudes. Bye. All right. Sorry about that, guys. My cousin called me. Uh, but yeah. Anyways. Uh, Stevenson gets on with a single one on nobody out and nobody in. They'll throw it over to check on Stevenson. He is back in there safely. Actually, they brung in a uh, pitch runner for Stevenson. I'm not sure who that is, but yeah, one on nobody out and nobody in here for the Reds in the bottom of the seventh. That one is outside the zone. One ball, no strikes to Jonathan India. That one is outside the zone. Hopkins, he's safe. <laughs> the Nationals are going to challenge this. Oh, bro. He's safer than the other guy was. If this is overruled, I'm going to be pissed. Yeah, he is safe by a half a mile. All right, Washington challenges. We'll see what they rule here. It better be safe. All that's all I know. But as you guys can see, what's up to the five people in the chat? The Reds are down by one right now, as it is uh, three to four.
Yes, sir. Let's go, baby. <clears throat> the runner is safe at first. I mean, at second, excuse me. And it, Washington loses their challenge. Let's go. Yeah, he was safe by days. All right, here we go. Two balls, no strikes. Jonathan and Nia, and Nia 0 for 3 on the evening. Now it's to the outside as well. Three balls, no strikes now to Jonathan India. All right, come on, India. That one is to the outside, and Jonathan India is on with a walk. Two on, nobody out, and nobody in here just yet. As Florio, I believe is how you pronounce his name, is the one pitching for the Washington Nationals. He's at five pitches and has already walked two guys. Well, actually, Tyler Stevenson hit on, and then uh, he just walked Jonathan India there. <clears throat> that one is outside the strike zone. One ball, no strikes. That one is outside the strike zone as well. And it's two balls, no strikes now. Will Benson, two for three. That one is in there for a strike. And it's floral, floral, excuse me, as it is two balls, one strike. Floral is the one pitching for the Washington Nationals. That one's hit on by Will Benson, but up and out of play. Two balls, two strikes. Come on, Will Benson. That one is swung on by Will Benson, but way too late, and he struck out. Uh, two on, one out, and nobody in here for the Reds. All right, Christian and the Carcion Strand is up now. He... It hasn't hit a single ball this season as that one is called a strike. It looks a little bit off the plate to me, but it's called a strike. No balls, one strike. Come on, man. That one is swung on. Christian and Nacarcion Strand. He grounds into a double play and the inning's over. Oh, my gosh, man. Top of the eighth. Reds are still down by one. This is terrible, man. This is absolutely terrible.
Oh my gosh, man. That one is in there for a strike. As Anton is pitching for us now, he appeared in five games last season, had a 0 0 record, an ERA of 1.58. That one is swung on, and he ripped it into left field. As he will come around, and Eddie Rosario will pull in with a stand up double. <clears throat> That one is outside the strike zone. One ball, no strikes. Garcia Jr. He's one for three on the evening. Anton is up to three pitches on the evening. That one is way outside the strike zone. Two balls, no strikes. Hmm. That one is outside the strike zone. Three balls, no strikes. That one is swung on and he missed it. Three balls, one strike on a sinker. Nice, nice throw there. Three balls, one strike. All right, come on, man. That one is outside the strike zone, and he walked in. Four balls, one strike. All right, Lipkin is up now. He's two for three on the evening. Anton has seven pitches. That one is apparently too far to the outside. One ball, no strikes. That one is way too high. Two balls, no strikes. That one is too high. Three balls, no strikes. He's getting ready to load the bases, man. Oh, my God. Yep. Yep. 100% agree with you, man. This is same old bullshit, man. We look like the same fucking Reds from years past. But yet, it, every single year, that they, they want to feed us this bullshit that, oh, we're getting better. 
We're going to be really good this year. We have a shot at winning the NL Central. No, the fuck you don't. No, the fuck you don't. I've only seen two and a half, three games this season that I've, I've watched. I've watched part of the, the first game on Thursday when I could because I was at work. And then I, I've watched the, last, yesterday's game and this game. And I can already tell from those two and a half games that I watched that we are not coming anywhere as close to winning the NL Central, man. So they can just stop with that fucking bullshit. No, that is not happening. No, that is not happening at all, man. All right. Well, we are up to nine votes now on the poll. Guys, if you haven't already, make sure to get your votes in because we will be ending them at the top of the ninth. But yeah, we're at nine votes right now on the poll. And nine, uh, 78% of you guys say yes, that we will win the series. And 22% says no, that we will not. All right, Fernando Cruz is up now with the bases loaded, and he throws one right down Broadway Street. Luckily, Abram did not swing at that. Otherwise, that would have been a grand slam. That one is swung on Abram. He luckily hits it foul, and he snowballs two strikes. That one is swung on, and he got Abram in three pitches. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Come on, Fernando Cruz. Get him, baby. That one is outside the strike zone, and it is one ball, no strikes. All right, Landon Thomas is up now. Landon Thomas is one for four. That one went spiraling down into the ground. That one is out to the side. Uh, two balls, no strikes. That one is swung on. Landon Thomas, it's popped up really well. That one is caught on. Will Bitson. He'll throw it in, and they got another run in. Was 
That one is a bit too high. One ball, no strikes. Uh, all we need is one more out. Come on, man. That one is swung on Jesse Winker, grabbed on, and he will get the out. So you got to give it to Fernando Cruz. Thank God he came in there and did work. We are down by two right now, heading into the bottom of the eighth. So we'll see what the Reds can do heading into the bottom of the eighth. But, yeah, it's better than what it could have turned out to be. Thank God they only scored one out of that. Uh, no, he's number four, but he has not done shit all season long, man. He doesn't even have a single hit on the season yet. So, you know, I don't know. John, I don't know, man. Honestly, don't know. These people be putting up really fucking stupid trades. Why the fuck would the Vikings give us Justin Jefferson? the 11th overall pick and the 23rd overall pick for them to only get the third overall pick back. That would be really fucking dumb. Really stupid. I, I don't, I don't get these dumb ass trades. All right. Anyways, as car, car, Car Carlo, Carlo, I forget how to fucking always pronounce his last name now. Uh, anyways, the dude that we just got from the Washington Commanders slash Chicago Cubs is up to bat now. He is, it's two balls, no strikes to him. Big hack, but he missed it. Two balls, one strike now. Bottom of the eighth for anyone just joining us. It's five to three. Washington Nationals lead it over the Cincinnati Reds. That one is swung, half swung on, hit it foul, two balls, two strikes. No, right. I agree with all of that. Our hitting has never been the problem, John. It's the fucking pitching. And if we lose again today... That's going to be the same fucking reason why we lost again today. Just like why we lost yesterday. I mean, granted, our defense was trash yesterday. But our defense has been pretty good here today. And there's one. It's a high fly. It's back there. It's off the wall. You've got to be kidding me. I thought for certain that it was a home run. But it's off the wall. Let's go, baby. He's in there with a stand-up double. I thought for certain it was gone, but it bangs right off the wall. Yeah, it died right at the end and bangs right off the wall. And he's in there for a double. Let's go. All right, Jake the Rake Fraley's in now. Big hack, but he missed it. 
no balls, one strike. Jake Fraley is three for three with three singles. But, yeah, like I was saying, John, our hitting has never been the problem. It's always been the pitching. And every year they feed us the same bullshit that is getting better, blah, 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 blah. And it, it doesn't get any better. You watch it, and it's actually getting fucking worse. So I, I don't know what to believe anymore. All right, no balls, two strikes. That one is swung on. Jake Fraley grabbed on by the first baseman, and he got him out. But the runner does advance to third base. So one out, runner at third base, and in comes De La Cruz. Yeah, honestly. Honestly, man. I thought it, like I said, I thought it was a home run there for a minute. But I guess not to be. As that one is in bottom of the zone to De La Cruz. No balls, one strike. De La Cruz, one for three. Harvey is in pitching for the Washington Nationals. He's up to 11 pitches on the evening now. One ball, one strike. That one is swung on by De La Cruz, but he hit it foul. One ball, two strikes now. Come on, De La Cruz. De La Cruz swings at one outside the strike zone. Luckily hits it foul, and it still remains one ball, two strikes. That's the thing De La Cruz has got to stop doing, man. you got to stop swinging at shit outside the strike zone, man. De La Cruz asks for time. And he does exactly what I said he just had to stop doing. He swings at one outside the fucking strike zone. He misses it. And that's out number two. Two out, one on, and nobody in here for the Reds. And this game might be over. All right, Spencer Steer is up now as that one is in there for a strike. No balls, one strike to Spencer Steer. Steer's two for two on the evening. Spencer Steer, that one's called a strike. It was outside the strike zone. Get the fuck out of here, man. Hmm. No balls, two strikes. That one is swung on by Steer. Grabbed down by the third baseman, thrown over, got him out, and this game is more than likely over, folks. This game is more than likely over, man. The Reds cannot do fucking shit. Oh, my God, man. All I'm saying is, is if we're struggling in a series like this already against the Washington Nationals, just watch out for when we play, you know, harder teams like Philadelphia, who we play tomorrow. But I'm talking like the major, major teams like New York Yankees and Houston Astros and Los Angeles Dodgers and shit like that. Wait till we play teams like that. We are going to get blown the fuck out. We are going to get blown out of the water by those teams. Like, deadass. Like, I'm talking like it might be 12 to nothing 
14 and nothing sometimes. It's over. Yeah, I'm starting to think the same thing. Uh, I, I'm hoping, I'm hoping you're right, John, because that's the one thing about De La Cruz, man. Don't get me wrong. He's an amazing player. He's great. He's really fucking fast. You can count on him for almost everything, but that little shit of where you swing at shit outside the strike zone and shit. No, nah, man, that he has got to get better at that because that shit is always costing us. Yeah, I mean, I don't think I don't think the 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 Cubs are going to do much, but I could definitely see the Brewers and um I don't know, maybe maybe the Cubs are, you know, I don't know. I got to watch and see the Cubs, but I don't know. So far they haven't looked great to me as Manzini is up now to begin off the ninth as it is no balls one strike. He swings at that one, hits it foul as it is now no balls two strikes. Joe Manzini is a one for three on the evening. Our Manson, I think is how you pronounce his name. And I'll say that he did not swing. Get out of here, man. He definitely broke the plate. All right, Fernando Cruz is no longer pitching for the Reds. It is Luis Sessis, or not Luis Sessis, excuse me. It is uh, Lucas Sims in there for the Reds. As that one is swung on by Joe Manson, and it is caught on out there in, uh, I think, center field by Will Benson. As that is out number one. One out, nobody on, and nobody in here for the Washington Nationals. All right, Joey Gallo is up now. What the hell are you talking about, Michael? One ball, no strikes to Joey Gallo. Gallo is 0 for 3. He walked his last time up. That one is in there for a strike. One ball, one strike now to Joey Gallo. That one is swung on by Joey Gallo and he missed it. One ball, two strikes now. That one is swung on Joey Gallo. High fly caught on Will Benson center field. Two outs, nobody on, and nobody in here for the uh, Washington Nationals. Oh, nice. All right, as Rosario, as Rosario, Rosario, however the fuck you pronounce his name, is up now. He is 0 for 4 in the evening. And that one's in there for a strike. That one is also in there for a strike. No balls, two strikes now. Come on, Lucas Sims. That one is down in the dirt. One ball, two strikes. That one is swung on. Bad break. Oh, are you kidding me, De La Cruz? 
Oh, you filthy animal. What a fucking catch. Are you serious? That should have been a hit. Taylor Cruz snags it. And that ends the inning. Wow. Where was that at yesterday, De La Cruz? Holy shit. No way that he just made that catch. Are you serious right now? Wow, man. <clears throat> All right, well, we're heading to the bottom of the ninth now with the Reds due up, still down by two. So we need at least two. Uh, to tie it, three to win it. All right, Kyle Finnegan is in now. Yesterday, he actually destroyed us. He went one inning, no hits allowed, one base on balls, and one strikeout. That one is outside the strike zone as Nick Martini is in now. He is one for two on the evening with a walk, a single, and a run. One ball, no strikes. That one is outside the strike zone, and it's called a ball still. One ball, one strike. Oh, my God, man. Wow. And I forgot to close the poll. Son of a bitch. That one is swung on by Nick Martini, and he missed it. One ball, two strikes. That one is outside the strike zone. Two balls, two strikes now to Nick Martini. Come on, Nick Martini. That one is swung on. High fly, just a pop out. And it's going to remain 2-2. Two, two. All right, two balls, two strikes. Finnegan is up to five pitches on the evening. That one is swung on. Nick Martini hung in the air too long, and that is out number one. One out, nobody on and nobody in here. All right, Luke Bailey is up now. He did home run yesterday. Can he do it again today? Last season, he played in 78 games. He had an average of 235, six home runs, and I'm not sure how many RBIs. That one is swung on. Luke Bailey grabbed on by this by the third baseman. Two out. This game is over, ladies and gentlemen.
Jonathan Indy out now. He's 0 for 3 on the evening. <clears throat> that one is downstairs, one ball, no strikes. That one is swung on by Jonathan India. He hit it foul, one ball, one strike. <clears throat> That one is outside the strike zone. Two balls, one strike now. Come on, Jonathan India. That one is outside the strike zone. Three balls, one strike to Jonathan India. Two out, nobody on and nobody in here for the Reds. That one is half swung on by Jonathan India. Hit foul. Three balls, two strikes. Hit foul again by Jonathan India. Three balls, two strikes still. Hmm. That one is swung on, hit foul again, Jonathan India, three, two count. Jonathan India had seven pitches this inning. That one is swung on by India. That one stays fair. Rose foul, very last second. Uh. All right, three balls, two strikes still. I thought that may have been a hit, but it rolled foul very last second. That one is swung on, and India hits it foul again. Three balls, two strikes still. India rips it in there to left field. Jonathan India does it again. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Great fucking hitting, India. Let's go, baby. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, well, Benson, he's two for four. He's the one up now. Hey, Rick's it! 
It's back there! Hey! Tiny head! Hey, Daddy! Will Benson! Are you fucking kidding me? Will Benson! He ties the game! In the bottom of the lane! Let's fucking go! This man is on fucking fire! Unreal! Let's fucking go! Bang, bang, bang! Some that muscle, baby! Let's fucking go! On fucking real Will Benson. Will fucking Benson. Are you kidding me? Bye, baby. Wow. When he fucking hit it, I didn't know if it had enough power or not. Then that bitch went flying right out the stadium. Oh, come on. Let's go, man. Let's fucking go, man. Let's go. All right, come on, Christian. Come on, Christian and the car on strain. First hit. Is it good? It is. Rex win it. Rex win it. Christian and the car on strain. His first, huh, his first hit of the season is a walk-off home run. Let's fucking go! Reds win it! Reds fucking win it! Reds win it! Christian to the Castillo strain with a solo walk-off home run. And the Reds win it! The Reds win it! Let's fucking go, man! What the fuck just happened? Wow! Oh my god! The Reds win it. Let's go. Let's go. All right, guys, in case you didn't, in case you couldn't hear me because I was too excited over here. Uh, so Jonathan India took it 10, took it 10 balls. All right, you know, took 10 pitches, kept on either fouling them off or taking balls. And then he finally lined one in there. To left field, he got on, and then Will Benson steps up. Very first throw of the inning, hits a two-run home run to tie the game. Christian Christian and Acarcion Strand comes in, and then takes a ball, or took a what should have been a ball, but he swung at it, which was a strike. And then the very next one was lined right over center plate. And he homered that one for his first hit of the season to win it for the Reds. Reds win it six to five, and we take the series. That is fucking wild the way that that just panned out. Let's go. That is absolutely insane. We needed two or more. Fucking Will Benson being Will Benson ties it for us. And then wouldn't you know, Christian and Acarcion Strand's first hit of the season. It's to win the game for us. It's to win the game for us. That is absolutely insane. Absolutely fucking insane. Let's go, baby. You love to see it. You love to see the fucking fight in this team, man. Let's go. Anyways, guys, I will see you tomorrow night. Happy Easter to everyone. Let's go. I'm alive right now because our Reds won it. Let's all say it together. This one belongs to the Reds, baby. Yes, sir. All right. Well, I am out of here. Yes, sir. That was a hell of a game. A hell of a game. Anyways, guys, I'm out of here. Enjoy the rest of your Easter. I know I'm about to get mine started. We're about to have a cookout and then later on have an Easter egg hunt. Until tomorrow night, I'm out. Peace.